Hey, hello everyone. Welcome. We're playing the demo for Garden Galaxy today. It's a cute little game that I found on Steam. I was really drawn to this, just from the art style of it. I just like the the colors and the models and stuff. It looks really pretty and cute. Uh, it looks like an idol or like sandbox game. Uh, so I imagine there's some decorating going on here with like garden stuff. Uh, the Steam description says to discover, collect and organize to create your own unique garden in this relaxing idol creative sandbox. Sounds very pleasant. So I suppose it's something kind of like Animal Crossing or something, but also not quite. It's a bit more minimalist. So I wanted to give this a go. So the settings, not much is going on here. So really, our main option is just to start a game. Oh! And it starts just like that. That's interesting. Pick up my little pot. And I suppose it says to put the coin in the pot. I can move it around. Oh! I see, you can also move the floor tiles around as well. I suppose you can trap it in the coin in there, see what happens. Oh! I get a little flower pot. Is this like the, the crafting pot, maybe? Oh! Oh, and these guys make little coins. I see, okay, so that's kind of how uh, uh, you progress then. You wait for those little guys to pop up and you click them and you get things. Yeah, okay. I guess that's how this game could be described as an idle game, is that uh, you wait for long enough and more of those guys appear, right? Yeah. Reminds me of like, yeah, pop cap games too, though. It was like Incense Aquarium, where like you got um, like little coins and stuff, you clicked on them. I guess like, um, Plants vs. Zombies was like that too, in a way. I guess I'll put those in here then. Yeah, okay. I figured I wanted like a plant in here, but I don't know how to do that. Seems like each coin like produces a different thing, right? See if I get the same thing here now. Oh, no, that's different. Okay, well I can put that on that. Cool, and I suppose uh, if I put the coin in here, I can store it. Sure can. Oh! Um, how do I get it out? Well, I don't know. It's in there now. It said something there, but I didn't get to read it. What happens if I put the blue coin in there? Oh! I got a different, like, piggy bank. I wonder if the, the like, if it makes a difference what it looked like? <laughs> oh. I don't know if I'm allowed to put this one in there. No, I'm not. Okay. <gasps> the rock. Gotta put that on that one. Yeah. How much can you stack in this? Okay, you're not allowed to invert the stack things. Can I like stack like this though? <gasps> I can, but then I can't put anything else on there. Fair enough. I suppose you just sort of buy things then, and then see what it gets you. Oh! <gasps> yeah, I got a uh, different tile there. So that expands my territory. I guess like I could do this as well then, right? Yeah. Oh, okay, I see. I thought I was the digging a pit there, but that's an optical illusion. So I can do that, but I'm gonna have a big old hole in the middle then if I do that. Oh, grass! Nice. You can start touching grass now. Isn't that great? What's this? I think one of my coins got trapped in the book. I'm not sure what's going on. I'm very confused. But like, pleasantly confused. It's like, they're putting things in and things are happening. It's just sort of pleasant and sweet. Oh, that's how that works. I was wondering like, how am I supposed to get a plant in a plant pot? You just put a plant in there and it works. That's very nice. I think things are moving quite fast here. Like, it's giving me a lot of these guys. Which, uh... It's giving me a lot of, like, coins to do stuff with. And, like, I'm just getting more stuff. Like, before... Oh, I just on the altar. I'm lucky I'm going to appear more often. Oh, I see. That's what that's for. Okay. So, um... Uh, yeah, things are just happening very fast. 
<laughs> if anything, I was kind of concerned actually that things would be really slow before Thunder. So I was like, oh, I don't know, is an idle game really going to be for me? I don't know if that's like my genre. Like, idle games have become really popular. But uh, I never really found a game which uh, I thought was like, yeah, that's the idle game I want to play, you know? Because I was like, nah, I just want to actually play the game, <laughs> you know? I don't need it to, like, do things for me. But uh, the way th this works just seems uh, uh, like it's a good pace, actually. I'm just going to put a bunch of stuff in here, even though I'm kind of daunted that, like, I'm going to be overwhelmed with options. Interact to change the background color. Oh, that's nice. Yeah, give me the green one. That was actually quite sweet. It's a good palette to this game. All the colors look lovely and nice. I like them. Let's see. Well, what's this one oh, no, done? Upgrade basic coins into water coins and broken. Oh, I see. Okay, yeah, okay, I see. So, um, this one is just like you put a bunch of coins in there and then... I get uh, a certain coin when it breaks, right? I guess this is how you can spend a lot of coins rather than just like getting a ton of stuff, right? Because now I'm like, I put a bunch of coins in there and then I just got like a huge amount of different random stuff here, which isn't maybe what I wanted. So I could like instead, what oh, I grew. Nice. Because then I'm going to put a bunch of coins in there. So it says five. There we go. Uh, I feel like I could do a little bit more. Just, there we go, six. And then break it, and then I get, yeah, a bunch of these little triangle coins. I don't know what to do. I guess I got a lot of plants now. Oh, plant pots. Put that in here, there we go. This plant here, did it always look like that? I feel like I saw some motion happen. I'm not quite sure what happened. I feel like it grew. Oh, big plant pot. Let's see, we can put something in there. I guess the sunflower? Yeah! Nice. And I guess uh, the um, flowers actually grow and put, it, put into a pot that big. Because they kind of shrunk a bit, like when put on other stuff, right? Can I put anything in that lily pad uh, box there? Nah. <laughs> I can put it on top of things, though. I don't know if I wanted them all to, though. Yeah, it definitely grows. What happens then? What happens when it grows? Can I do anything? I don't know. What is this? A little planty. Okay. A little combaddy. Or whatever. <laughs> I don't know plants. I don't know, it's supposed to look like something. I guess this is like a... Like a... Onion or something, right? <laughs> oh, hello. Put that down there. Getting a nice little area here with a... A bunch of area for, for plants. It's very nice. I kind of want more plants. Uh, did I get that from here? Oh, okay, so the water drop thing is giving me... Water related things like this, right? That's cool. Yeah, I'm getting a lot of these things from uh, these triangle coins. Oh, hang on. Do you get to a certain point where you like, have all the plants? So it just starts giving you tiles instead. That might be how it works. But, uh... How do I get, like, uh, more of those... Uh, Piggy banks now. I guess uh, with like regular coins, right? Oh, no, that's a different one. I guess I just got the, you know, a certain, certain luck. Was that an item for a while? What is this book about? Oh, oh, I see. The lily pad goes in that one. Okay, that's what uh, these are for then. They are plants, they just need uh, a body of water to live in. That's nice. I see a water coin at the bottom here, I want it. I want it. 
So right now, everything is kind of a mess, obviously. Um, I would like to organize things a bit better, but uh, I, I don't want these, like, um, these tiles here. I want, like, more grass and stuff. I guess what I can do to achieve that is put the grass here, right? And then, like, start putting money in here, and then, like, I would maybe get more of these things. Yeah, like that. There we go. It's a bit more friendly looking. So like this. Little cactus. That's a good friend. We got him on those. Oh, and uh, I like these. This will be a good path at some point. Maybe I should like sort my floors in a way so I can um, I can uh, later put them where I want them. You know. I think I need more water tiles. So I guess I should um, put a bunch of money in this uh, uh, piggy bank here. So I can hopefully get a, a few decent uh, like tiles to put my plants in. There we go. Oh no, no, no. Hang on, there's my money, I didn't see it, it was blending in. <laughs> it just looked like a plant for a second. Money growing on grass, wouldn't that be nice? Oh, there's another piggy bank, nice. I probably overdid it a little bit here, but I didn't want to leave like extra money, you know. I wanted it to be like exact. No, that's not what I want. You can put it on it, but not in it yet. <laughs> rocks, sure. Just make up a little um, stack of rocks here, as, as you do. I don't need another piggy bag. Uh, no, that's not what I want either. Oh, that's what I want. But now I've got so many other plants. <laughs> what do you do? What do you do when you get a mess in this game? I don't understand. Oh my god, I'm just making such a mess. I guess I can break these and then not have to worry about them. Uh, but I don't know how to do anything else here. Ooh. Oh, things are happening here now. I was wondering what was the deal with this uh, catalog here. Oh, and you can zoom out quite far. So you could eventually have like a, a quite spacious garden then, right? I guess like... A good way for me to sort of tidy things up a bit. Is it, what if we just start a garden at like a random point here? Like this is where my garden starts. I don't think of it that way. Now I kind of want like water surrounding this path for a little while. And I guess for for now we could have I could have like cacti and other what are these things called again? Succulent plants. Uh, flank in the path. That's lovely. That's nice. Uh, and then like, <laughs> I run out of path. I guess I'm gonna have to have a different path now. <laughs> Can I have some more grass? Oh, I like these things. How did I rotate things? I don't. Uh, did I say like R oh, or something? I don't know how to rotate. Oh, F. I can rotate it like that. There we go, right click. I thought it was right click. Ah, um, oh, I see. I was pressing right click when I was holding it, and that doesn't work. Ah, oh, but no, it doesn't go there, though. I guess it, that doesn't uh, that doesn't work. But this will find a place somewhere where it'll, it'll look cool, I think. Oh, there's so much stuff. What is this? Interact to change the time of day. Oh, that's lovely. I guess you could have like a control panel like this, basically. Where you put uh, like utility items like this, like the book. Sort of have like a hotbar, basically. 
So items near to keep things tidy. Oh, that's nice. If one I got one of these things a long time ago, that would have helped. Bucket? What's the bucket doing thing? Oh, that might actually be a... Yeah, it is actually a, a pot. That's, that's amazing. I love that. That's great. I'm electing to go for the darker look here, because that's uh, extra cozy. Like this, uh, these lanterns are giving off a really nice light like this, I think. I really like that. Ooh, a sunflower. Oh, I can plant things in the grass. Oh, that's nice. Oh, that's cute. That's very cute. That's very cute. Can anything go in that? I guess this this thing. Yeah. Very nice. Oh! Oh, nice bonsai tree. You know what? You can go in that one. I think that'll be really cute. Yes. So what I'm discovering quickly is it's really easy to just make a mess in this game and not very easy to organize things very much at all. I'm really struggling with that part. I'm gonna try my best to, to make something over here with what I've got at least. It's not giving me any ground to work with. That's some ground, thank you. And uh, in that I can put uh, this one. Oh, there we go, thank you. I suppose what I should be doing is put even more stuff in this one. Oh, it's stacked! These, um, these things, they're identical. So I can think about them later, that's really nice. So I can just, yeah, put it in there. Not have to think about them. Hmm, I think I might actually store a good amount of stuff. No, I need a coin. I'll do that in the piggy bank, because I don't know what it is. So why not? Upgrades basic coins into gold coins when broken. Oh, that's nice. All right, so put anything that's not a gold coin in there. All right, it's got two. Let's uh, crack it up and see what it's going to do. Yeah, there we go. Well, I don't know how worth it that was, but I guess if you're looking specific for gold coins, it's probably worth it, yeah, <laughs> probably. Uh, you might have guessed that uh, I do not know how to make any gardens, and you will be correct. <laughs> I love this one though, I love these pots with animals on them, they're very cute. I think this one would be nice in it. Yeah, it's like a fun little frog mohawk, right? This frog is amazing. A friend, the bestest of friends, me and this frog. I made a terrible mess. You know what, these rocks would be kind of cool. Like, mm, no, maybe not. They're too big. <laughs> I was thinking of having stepping stones, but they're much too big. Well, it's a, it's a stepping stone for someone that wants to, um, you know, like uh, jump and skip. <laughs> Skipping stones. Oh, <gasps> weather. I'm gonna keep it like this. That's nice. Though. I'll uh, move another block over here so we can manage that. I think that's the way to do it. So if there was something here I didn't like very much, like I didn't care for, like, like this pot here. Oh, <gasps> I can put it in there get a refund. Okay. Yeah. Okay. That's how we deal with a mess. You can sell things. You don't just have to deal with things. Like, clogging up the system. You can do that, and then it sorts itself out. Okay, that, that's that's quite helpful. <laughs> I was really thinking that, like, well, I guess you just have to, like, deal with the infinite mess you make, and there's nothing you can do about it. And I was, I was worried. Hello, my comfy. There's no space for it anywhere. <laughs> oh no. My hoarding habits in display for everyone. It's not selling things. 
of like these pots here. I can't, re I can't reach things anymore because there's so much stuff. No! <laughs> what a disaster. Oh, coin. Is that in there? Oh, that can go in here. There we go. That's a pretty one. Is that a lotus? Might be. I don't know. I don't know plants. I guess this is like a fence. That's interesting. <gasps> oh my god. Now this is interesting. It's a little face guy. You can spit at the plant all day. That's your job. <laughs> oh no, I got more planks. I don't know what to do with these planks now. What am I supposed to do with them? Stack them on top of each other? No, that's not good. That doesn't make any sense. It doesn't belong there. I think I could like make this whole thing a bit wider though, right? Like this sort of thing. Have a double path. Although I could always just, you know, recycle it too. Not have to worry about extra planks I didn't know what to do with. Oh, the tree is so big now. Look at it. It was such a little baby before. It's all grown up. Uh, let's just start selling things. Oh, no, I like this one. It's kind of cool. Yeah, I kind of like the idea of like doing these styles of uh, plants here. I don't know if I care for these uh, sunflowers. They can, they can go. Also this one. What is this? Is like a bok choy? Get out of here. And that gives me a lot of coins. Now I could like, if I wanted to, make another piggy bank, right? And do like a little piggy bank thing. What was this one? I don't remember what this one was. <laughs> I'm sure it was something helpful. Let's try it. Two. Ribbon. Oh, okay. It's uh... ah leaf. Leaf coins. I don't know what those are. That's a big rock. Huge. Oh, I, I just got like a neat idea as well. We can have like different kinds of plants for like the different kinds of areas you're in, right? So, um, like around this rock, uh, like biome, I can have like a rock garden and stuff. And like these rocky, like pots, you know, that sort of thing. But like, I can have a wet area around the grass here. That'd be kind of cool, right? I think, I think that works. Bloop. Oh, a little kitty. Lucky kitty, you gotta want, I want those. Maybe I'll actually get what I want now. <laughs> so clearly this game is very pleasant. It's, uh, it's really nice and calm and, and sweet. Even if I am very terrible at it, <laughs> it's just kind of pleasant and nice. I really like that about it. Like, I'm really struggling here to get a um, garden that looks nice at all. But I feel like they're giving me tools to make it happen, you know? Like, with I, I could. I could do it with time, you know? Hang on, what's this one? Oh, there's like different books for different coins, I see. So that's, this is like another... Um, a degree of like how to play this game then, right? It's like collection as well. Like, oh, I'm missing something so in, the, in the gold tier. I get it. I guess uh, that's what the coin in there was. I was wondering what it was. I figured like, oh, I guess it just kind of looks like a coin without being a coin. But, uh, the way it like sort of delivers items to you after, um, like over time as well, it's like nice because it means that, um, you will eventually get the sort of garden you want, and but uh, you kind of have to like work yourself towards it, you know? It, it isn't just like a sort of 
uh, hocus pocus uh, method to get in there. You, you gotta like eventually get there. And um, you sort of make yourself relax a bit and enjoy the process uh, getting there. It's not getting there as soon as possible, it's just sort of about having a pleasant time with the garden and you know, you walk it, work yourself towards where you want to be. Even if you don't get it right away. That's alright. Oh, let's go, guys. The more I expand, the harder it is to actually spot them. They kind of spawn everywhere. <laughs> and I'm like, oh, I could have gotten so much money, but I didn't see them. These guys have got to have a little campfire to, to keep warm, you know? That's money. Oh my god, another one. Yes. What goes in this one? I guess there's something funny by putting the trees in the, in the cats. It's very cute. There is a cat village here. This is where it's happening. Oh, all little feline buddies at home over here. Can I stack the more heads? I can. Yes. Oh, that's so good. I kind of like the idea of these things, like watering different things. Like that, you know. It's like I'm so high. <laughs> it just keeps going. Oh, that's that's good. That's good. That's where that goes for sure. So as long as something is like a mower head here, where it's you know flat at the bottom and the top, you can stack things pretty infinitely, right? That's really funny. This is kind of like um, a weird version of playing like with like a puzzle, you know? Kind of waiting for your thing to appear. Um, and when it appears to you, you're like, oh, you, you snap it in the place uh, it belongs, you know? <laughs> but like, it's a bit backwards. <gasps> oh, kitty friend. Nice. <laughs> Yeah, there's no range uh, requirement on the, on the little plate as well. So that tidies up things a lot, if it, did, it always just go here. That's nice. I think I would have liked to have more um, boxes. I've got a couple now, but I kind of like uh, sorting things, you know? So if we could have like a box for each sort of thing, that would be really helpful for, like, uh, getting things organized, you know? Like, this box can have all the plants. But at some point, this, uh, I'm gonna need to store all the non-plant things as well, if I only have, like, two boxes to store things in, in it, you know? I guess I can try it, so this one... Not using for anything right now. I have, I have some plant spots here, actually, that I can put things. Oh, hang on, that doesn't go anywhere. The bucket has to stand somewhere here. Uh. Oh, it's a mess! <laughs> I want this though, I want it here. I guess you can kind of get to a point in the game where like... You, you're just sort of um, trying to get lucky, you know? So you just sell everything you can. I don't know if I should sell these tiles here. It seems to be dangerous, but you can. But like, instead of, you know, just trying to use the things it give, gives you, you just try to replicate things you already have a bunch, right? <laughs> Oh, 
it's such a mess. <laughs> I guess we can just take stock of what I made already here. And just admire this garden I made. <laughs> you know, given a few hours of this, I feel like we might get to a point where this could be like a presentable garden. <laughs> Maybe? It feels nowhere near right now though. It's um, it's a disaster. I will freely admit that I have made an absolute just mess here of stuff and I'd, I'm, I'm struggling to make something that isn't just a mess. <laughs> Let's just try to sell some things. I'm not using these things here anyway. I guess I wasn't too thrilled about them, you know? I think what I really want is just like more more tiles for things to live in, right? So let's just let's just sell things. Like uh, I'll keep I'll keep my favorite things. I feel like I'm pretty confident about which things are my favorite things. I think it's pretty visible even. <laughs> so I can just sell things that uh, that do not belong. Because over here. Not getting a lot of those things that uh, I would consider to be one of my favorite things uh, right now, though. It's a bit odd. Considering I got this one thing here for spawning things, which I want. Let's see. Quince. Hang on, where's the guys? Give me stuff. I don't. I'm this one. I feel like I haven't seen them in a while. Oh my god, there they are. Sneaky! <laughs> you gotta look for the lights, I guess. That's a lot of uh, weather winds. I don't want them. I don't need these. Oh no! They could do the platters! Stop it! Oh, damn, that has. My kingdom for the, the the planky thing, the planky floor. Gimme. Maybe I'm misunderstanding something. Maybe I need a special kind of coin for it to spawn. Oh, there's that book. Great. There it is. That popped off a gold coin. Oh, I have two of these houses already. So I guess I can definitely sell that one. Hmm. That would that would be like the wall for this sort of area, then. <laughs> can I put a house on that? Oh my god, I can! That makes no sense, but I'll I'll take it. <laughs> it's kind of neat. I think you can build uh, like kind of exactly what you want with this. Just given enough time, because uh, just getting like money from these guys is gonna give you a lot of. Uh, like money to put in these piggy banks, right? And uh, I think these things are a way to get like exactly what you kind of desire, right? Like if you wanted to do a lot of water gardening, well, it makes sense to just put a bunch of coin and pull them into the piggy bank here, right? I think it'll take some extra time doing that, but I think that's the sort of thing you're playing this for anyway, right? Just chilling with the, chilling with the time you have. You, you you boot this knowing that you just wanna like uh, hang out with uh, some some fun games for a little while, you know. I feel like I haven't gotten any of the thing I actually requested for from the altar. Strangely, maybe these things are kind of rare. Oh, it is just from the gold book. See, this that's how it works. That's how we're gonna think about it. Yeah, some from the copper coin. You get these things. The gold coin, you get these things. And the silver coin, you get these things. Right, okay, yeah. That makes a lot of sense. So if I want the, um, the plank here, I gotta spend a gold for it. There we go. Okay, so that, that's... Um, is why I had a bit of an illusion then of feeling like I was unlucky. Because it was literally not possible to get everything I wanted from... Uh, the thing I was spending there. 
So in order to solve that problem, you'd have to use these uh, piggy banks in, right? And that's why you want to use piggy banks for, for getting things. Like, if I want a specific thing right now, well, this copper coin isn't going to do it. So I'll just put it in the piggy bank, right? Oh, it's... Okay, so it's, it's rather consistent and about give, giving you what you want. Fair enough. Again? Oh, not, not again. <laughs> it's tried. It, it, it did really well up until it didn't. <laughs> it's a very chill game. And I think we're starting to run out of, of things to do. Right now, we're just trying to make the perfect garden. I'm not quite sure if I'll forget that. <laughs> I think this might be a good time to call it. But uh, I have enjoyed my time at Garden Galaxy. And it's been uh, a fairly generous demo. It doesn't give me a huge array of things to do. But like with the things they've given me here. You know. I'll just open all the books. Try to open all, open all the books here. So I can show you. There's a decent amount of stuff here to build a garden with. Like just in the demos. That's uh, always nice. I really enjoy that. And I have looked at the um, screenshots of the game too, and I've seen them come up with a lot of quite nice things. I think uh, I can see myself playing this for like a few hours uh, when I've got some downtime, you know. There's a lot of uh, people that enjoy um, like just playing things and watching things, like at the same time though. I do that a lot, and... I think this will be the perfect thing for it, right? I think that's what, like, is perfect about idle games in general, right? <laughs> I could see myself uh, being quite relaxed in the evening, playing this and watching some video essays or listening to some music or whatnot. I think this would be a lovely time. Uh, so I think we'll call the video the... Uh... Yeah, we'll do a little save and exit. Oh, and it shows the uh, save you made in the background. That's lovely. That's really, that's really pleasant. That's nice. So this has been Garden Galaxy. I had a good time with this. Uh, it's not out yet. It is planned to be released in 2022. Uh, so stay tuned on Steam, I suppose. And uh, I hope to catch you next time for another demo. Take easy, everyone. Thanks for watching. Bye.